When it comes to managing difficult, persistent, or inflexible nuts, the one thing you can count on is an impact wrench. It will give you value for time and energy saving. Yet, if you are in the market for a dependable and well-made model, take note that a myriad of impact wrenches is available in the market, which can be quite daunting if you don't know what you are searching for. Fortunately, this extensive guide will assist with your buying decision and decide whether you should go for air or electric powered impact wrench. But certainly, that choice will rely primarily on two factors, usage frequency and the type of work you do. Cordless impact wrenches certainly have the upper hand here in terms of weight. Built for speediness and movability, they have lighter internal components, although the battery does leave them somewhat bottom heavier. On the flip side, air impact wrenches are quite bulky and most often heavier. The internals are often made up of metal, increasing their heft, and in many cases, adding to the mass is an air hose that can be troublesome at times. But they make up for their magnitude by providing heavier levels of user torque. This one can be a tricky question to respond to. However, air-powered models have the edge. Pneumatic wrenches don't depend on an internal hammer system and utilize compressed air for furnishing substantial torque, effortlessly removing or slackening inflexible nuts and bolts. Simply speaking, in many circumstances, they are stronger than different kinds. Nevertheless, as touched on previously, battery-powered models are steadily overtaking and it might not continue much longer. Yet, if you need a great deal of strength, battery-powered wrenches will quickly become drained. For difficult tasks, air-powered impact wrenches remain the absolute best. The answer you're looking for is a clear victory. Cordless torque wrenches, of course. Electric engines don't have many components that require upkeep. All you need to make sure of is that the batteries are powered up and good to go. Even if one does wear out eventually, you can merely buy another one. Since wire-free wrenches are suitable for periodic use, you don't have to stress over normal use and tear. Conversely, pneumatic wrenches can be somewhat of a nuisance to maintain. They're bigger, require thorough oiling habitually, and some internal components might need to be replaced frequently. It is important to note that electric motors can't really be refurbished as air impact wrenches can. Locating replacement parts is also much more difficult, so when something breaks, it tends to be easier to simply replace the entire motor. Cordless wrenches come out ahead here, as the extra weight of air-bearing wrenches makes them burdensome to use for longer stretches. It leads to far more wrist wariness too. What's more, given that they generate such an abundance of power, they vibrate much more as well. Conversely, Cordless wrenches grant enhanced flexibility and handiness, only clocking in at 2 to 3 pounds. Also, due to their more compact size, cordless wrenches can be employed in places that are harder to access, certainly an advantage not to overlook. You may be astounded, but we arrived at a deadlock on this one. Air-powered impact wrenches are ordinarily less expensive than battery-powered ones, yet since you'll need to get an air compressor, a hose line, and a reel, all things considered, they aren't precisely affordable. Obviously, you'll have the option to utilize that air compressor to utilize huge amounts of different pneumatic tools, yet the venture is as yet generous. The range of prices is extremely broad, from an expensive models that cost $100 as an access point to more expensive ones of $1,000. What you finally select will rely on your particular needs, how much use it will get, and budget. Unluckily, there's no definite answer in this case. Each of them has respective strengths and weaknesses and are employed for divergent goals. For example, if you need an impact wrench for regular jobs such as functioning in your garage, then a pneumatic wrench might be your best selection. On the assumption that you can't put up an air compressor in that region, Certainly, it shall come along with a few drawbacks. However, nothing surpasses an air impact wrench when it concerns power and performance. 
Throughout this video, we have attempted to spot the differences between these two in order to support you. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Please inform us which one is most suitable for your requirement.